WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento with the Mid-Afternoon Update for TFNN. We've got a section on the stocks are red. They started out green. They change colors in the middle of the day sometimes from green to red. Right now they're down. The U.S. dollar is weakening today a little bit, so we have strength in the currencies. We have gold bouncing back after a big $100 drop. These last couple of days we've rallied back about $30 from the bottom. Silver's rallied back about $0.50. Cents. So those markets are trying to make a bottom down in this area. And then also, if we take a look at copper, copper has also bounced back a little bit, which is uh, uh, something that could be a positive to stocks. The main thing is that the Federal Reserve chairman came in and talked about the fact that uh, they may be close to changing and they might not be close to changing. So <laughs> I don't know what that means. But, you know, folks, if you just follow the charts, if prices go up, there are more buyers. If prices go down, there's more sellers. That's the main thing that you want to try to recognize when you're doing some of these things as you go through looking at some of these things. And natural gas continues to, uh, to move higher, uh, which always is a nice sign. And also, we've had a uh, nice move. Uh, in the corn market, finally, it's rallied about 20 cents off the bottom. Still not anything in the record books, but at least it stopped going down. Soybeans, not so much. It keep, they keep going lower and lower. Someday they'll have a bottom, but it probably won't be today. That's about the bottom line of what we're watching right now. Remember, folks, these crops are just being planted now. So there's going to be some problems all the way through the, the, the growing season. It's always been that way, and it's not going to be any different this time. And all always remember, when prices go up, they also have the possibility of going down. And that's there's not just any one-way street with the exception of, of the stock of NVIDIA. It seems to want to be going up forever. And I don't know if it's still going up today, but it had a huge move. But we did make a big ABCD expansion uh, at uh, 13,960. Uh, that was the ABCD level, and we hit that exact number in the NASDAQ. It was a perfect ABCD. It's only backed off 200 points, which isn't anything considering it goes up to and 300 points a day. So that's just nothing more than a very small correction in a bull market. So we're going to take a break, folks. 877-927-6648. Our guest today is Bill Meridian, Cycles Research. 